So you play the villain in this film. Must be very challenging. Let's talk about playing the villain. How much fun was that as an actor? Well, I always play the villain. I have a German accent. I always play the villain, of course. Uh, but this was a funny villain, you know, and I was like, uh, I had a little bit of difficult time because Adam suggests that I might be gay, you know, and I didn't think that was a good idea. Just because I want to, you know, stick up uh, something up his ass doesn't make me automatically gay, you know. That's a torture thing, not a gay thing, you know, so... For example, that's that's one of the... Sounds like some craziness went down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Some crazy stuff went down. Working with Adam Sandler, he has a lot of crazy ideas. Was there any improv on the set? Yeah, he's, what, what, what is just amazing is how fast he is and how perfect he comes up with all sorts of crazy stuff. Um, you know, so you, you, you have your lines, you do something, and then, boom, he kind of hits you with something uh, amazing, new, weird, uh, extreme, you know. He throws something out there, and then you're playing back and forth with him. Do you, do you come up with funny lines, too? Are you quick? Well, I'm not as quick as Adam, you know, but, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's good to respond to him, you know. I'm good in responding. I'm not as good in, boom, you know, coming up with something, you know, like he does. And of course we had lines, it was not like uh, Funny People, for example, where it was almost all improvising, you know. Why should people go see this movie? And of course it's on Netflix, that's awesome. What's it about this film that people must check it out? Well, the, the cool thing is that, uh, the, the cool thing is, is, is that, that, that it's a little different than the other Adam movies, you know, because he, he, the main part is played by David Spade as the accountant. So he plays kind of like the cool guy. Uh, and he is a wonderful cool guy, you know, because he's kind of still who he is. And he has this big heart that comes across all the time anyhow, even if he plays like a cool guy. Uh, and he supports that little idiot, David Spade, in this, in this role, you know. He plays that sad, sad little guy. And he shows him life and uh, he gets into life and then all the bad stuff happens and part of the bad stuff is me, of course, you know. Ah, well, you know, this movie is called The Do-Over. What's one thing that you would love to do over in your lifetime? What I would like to do over? Um, well, that's a good question. Uh, probably, I wish my daughter would be four years ag again, four years old, because now she's 29 and I would like to have her like being like my little little thing again, you know. You're such a sweetheart. I'm sure she's proud of you. Congratulations. We're looking forward to checking you out in the do-over.